as per 23rd video we will do about the human circulatory system you didn't subscribe our channel yet subscribe us for more videos like this first we should discuss about the structure of the heart the heart has four chambers, an upper part called as atria and lower called ventricles. These are the left and right atriums, and these are the left and right ventricles. They are the having two valves between these atriums and ventricles. Bicuspid valve located between left atrium and left ventricle. Tricuspid valve located between right atrium and right ventricle. There are the two arteries called aorta and pulmonary. Aorta start from Left ventricle by pulmonary artery starts from right ventricle. They are having seminuna valves and they start from aorta and pulmonary artery. Superior and inferior vena cava open to the right atrium while left and right pulmonary veins open to the left atrium. So, the heart you can see like this. Now, we see how it works. Deoxygenated blood filling into the right atrium by inferior and superior vena cava. Same time, oxygenated blood filling into the left atrium by pulmonary vein. After filling right and left atriums, that blood transfer into right and left ventricles through the valves. Since the contraction and relaxing of ventricle walls after filling blood into them, pump to aorta and pulmonary artery respectively. Deoxygenated blood in the pulmonary artery pass to lungs and oxygenated blood in aorta distribute blood to whole body. So, you can see now about blood circulation. First, you can see plasma. Then, white blood cells. Then, platelets. And last, red blood cells. In this time, bicuspid and tricuspid valves are closing. So, we can hear love sound. After entering blood into pulmonary artery and aorta, seminuna valves get closed by preventing enter of blood back to ventricles. In this time, love sound is forming. Arteries are the blood vessels that take blood away from the heart and veins are the blood vessels that pass blood towards heart. So, veins and arteries making a complicated structure by connecting capillaries. We can represent it as follows. Then, we should discuss about the components of blood. Blood can be categorized into two called corpuscles and plasma. Corpuscles are three types called red blood cells, white blood cells and platelets. While the plasma contains water, things soluble in water, things insoluble in water. We can see the blood in red color, but the 54% of it is liquid form. It is called as plasma. It is in yellow color. The other 45% of it contain corpuscles in solid form like platelets, red blood cells and white blood cells. Then we can see the function of blood. 
us about red blood cells. It contains hemoglobin. Hemoglobin carries oxygen from lungs to body cells. It gives blood color as red. Then, white blood cells. It destroys pathogens and produces antibodies. It categorizes into neutrophils, eosinophils, basophils, lymphocytes, and monocytes. After that, platelets. Yes, due to clotting of blood and some viruses cause a rapid decline in platelet percentage. Example, dengue. Then about plasma. Transporting substances dissolved in the plasma. A certain blood sample configured with scientific spine, we can separate corpuscles and plasma as follows. The function of plasma like this. It transports digestive products, vitamins and minerals. It transports the excreted products and hormones, proteins, enzymes and gases of their relevant parts of the body. Now, we can see about blood transfusion. Transferring of blood from a one person to other known as blood transfusion. The person who donates blood known as the donor while who receives blood called as recipient. Compatibility and research factors should be considered when donating blood. When transferring blood, compatibility of the blood group must be considered. It is like this. A to A can. A to B can. A to AB can. A to O can. B to A can. B to B can. B to A B can. B to O can. A B to A can. A B to B can. A B to A B can. A B to O can. O to A can. O to B can. O to A B can. O to O also can. Then we should consider about universal donor and the reception. The universal donor means the blood group that can donate all other blood groups, and universal reception means the blood group that can receive the blood from all other blood groups. O blood group is called the universal donor, while the universal reception is AB blood group. With all these considered after, compatibility of research factor also be considered. I represent it by this graph. Rh plus 2 Rh plus can Rh plus 2 Rh minus can Rh minus 2 Rh plus can Rh minus 2 Rh minus also can When unmatched blood transfused, the blood can be agglutinated. It is called the blood agglutination. It causes the sudden death of a person. After that, we show you the favorable habit to maintain healthy blood circulatory system. Control the conditions like diabetes and high blood pressure. Refrain from smoking and liquor. Reduce consumption of fatty foods. 
reduce mental stress. Engaging in physical exercises daily. You can answer these questions in comment section. What are the four chambers of heart? What are the arteries connected to ventricles? What is the organ that transport blood to lungs? What percentage that blood in liquid form? What are the three types of corpuscles? What is the function of blood? Thank you for watching our video. Goodbye all!